everybody, my name is Natalie and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a craft out of things you hopefully have around your house. So to get started today, you are going to need two cupcake liners. Um, you're going to need some paper, um, whatever you like to color with, so crowns or colored pencils. Um, you're going to need some scissors and glue. And then only if you want to, you don't have to use these items. Um, you can use a popsicle stick, some yarn, and like a small... Um, pom pom or poof ball, whatever you want to call it. But out of all these things, I'm going to be showing you how to make a little um, fish craft. Okay? So first you're going to need to cut your two um, cupcake liners. So you want to kind of flatten one out like this. And then you're going to want to take your scissors And you're going to want to cut like a triangle out to get a mouth for your fish. Okay, so that's going to be your fish's body and there's his mouth. And then you want to take your other cupcake liner and you're going to want to take it and you're going to want to fold it in half like this. So, And then you're just going to kind of cut that up into a couple, like maybe two or three pieces, kind of like this. All right. And now you've got a tail and a fin. So you'll lay those, you'll glue these to your fish like this. As you can see, my fingers are in the way. So you'll have a fin and a tail and there's your fish's mouth, okay? So once you've glued, glued all your fish together, um, you'll wanna glue him to a piece of paper. I just chose blue because I wanted it to look like my fish is swimming. Um, and then I wanted to kind of make the page a little bit more cute. So of course you wanna give your fish an eyeball. I just used some markers. Um, I went ahead and drew on the page a little bit to kind of make it look like he's underwater. I made some waves and some rocks and plants. Um, but if you don't have a popsicle stick and all this stuff, you can just draw this on or your fish doesn't have to be, um, you know, eating or biting anything. It can just be swimming. But if you want to look like someone's fishing, you can use a popsicle stick or you can draw on there to create kind of like the pole and the line and then of course some bait. So. I just used a popsicle stick, some yarn, and a little pom-pom for that. But you absolutely don't have to. You can just draw those on there. Um, and I just glued them on. So once I had my fish on there and I decorated the page how I wanted, I just took some glue and glued all of that on there. And there's my fish. I hope this wasn't too complicated and I hope it was fun. Um, if you wanted to do this craft and you realize that maybe you didn't have some of the items needed, um, we do have kits available for pickup. Just give us a call and we will let you know what we have, okay? Thanks, guys.